Yes, sir. It's your boy Hayes. We back with another one, guys. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, watch out for spam, WhatsApp, in the comments down below. Feel free to join VIP to get alerted whenever we get in and out of plays. DM me on Instagram at the B Hayes Show underscore. DM join. Also, feel free to hit me up for a 15 minute, 30 minute phone call full of value, full of gems. Let's go ahead and dive right into it, guys. Get you guys in and out of here. Quick update, some game, you know, gems, uh, update on the overall market, whatever comes to mind, guys. You know, we keep it real, keep it raw, whatever, you know, no script, none of that. We just make our videos unedited. So, anyways, let's go ahead and take a look at it, see what's going on with the overall market. Talk about a few plays that we went crazy in. VIP has been going bananas. I called out, like, what, five plays a day in VIP, and every single one of them hit. Uh... I'm trying to think. It was one play that we that probably didn't hit. No, that was Neo. Neo that we had called out, and that was an earnings play. Earnings play don't really count. It count, but it don't count, meaning it's not up to my knowledge, my experience, my expertise, or my intricacies to give me the foundation of multiple home runs or multiple win rates with earnings plays because regardless of what the news is what the whether they beat expectations whether they make a lot of money or not the earnings could go could send a stock going either direction so that's why i always advise my people to stay safe and do it smartly meaning we only put in a hundred two hundred three hundred dollars depending on your risk tolerance and level and watch that turn into six hundred or a thousand or whatever the case may be but don't go and try to put thousands on it and try to get you know a buttload of money because it could go wrong but then anyways shout out to the members guys they went crazy today uh shout out to myself as well did like two twenty five hundred three thousand dollars today twenty five hundred three thousand dollar range you even got some people in vip they did better than me and be doing better than me no no hate my way i love it i love to see it guys like i had said it before in one of my videos i like someone probably make a million dollars or a million dollars off my plays before i do hopefully i do first but or i ain't gonna say hopefully i don't really care who do it first but i'm just saying like it's cool ain't nothing wrong with that it's all depends on the individual risk tolerance i know i done learned from my mistakes that's why i bring it here to share it with you guys so i know my risk tolerance some people may say well if you know how to do this you know how to do it, why you don't just make a hundred thousand a day why you just because i'm not putting fifty thousand on the line to try to make no hundred K in a day. I'd rather be okay with my hundreds of dollars, a few thousand here. Sometimes I even make a five figure play. I'm okay with that, but I'm very rare. So anyways, let's get right back into the nitty gritty. As we can see guys right here. Let me show you guys this. I flew to Toronto, I linked over between my guy D May, shout out to you fam. He, he made $6,000 off VIP off the play today. He could have made $8,000. I don't know why it won't focus. But you can see it like kind of now. He could have made $8,000, but he ain't sell at that point. So he ended up making six, which is great. Phenomenal. Who's making $6,000 in a day? Not too many fields, not too many people. And right after that, another person hit me up off of $550. Shout out to Curtis. Curtis Collins, off of $550, he up. Well, he sold for $3,200 profit, if you can see that. $3,200 profit. I had to turn that angle so you can see. That's insane, guys. Off of $550. I had another guy off just $10. He made $120. That's insane. That's just like having $1,000 and turning it to a thousand. I meant $10,000. Uh, $10 to $120, that's like having $1,000 and turning it to like $12,000. So that's insane off of 10 bucks. I'm pretty sure he, you know, until spot probably didn't have much to start with. I have, now he's like, dang, I'm kind of up a little bit, especially starting with 10. But anyways, as you guys see, got a lot more, but I ain't gonna, can't go through all them. But anyways, if we go ahead and take a look at it, guys, we know that the feds isn't done raising interest rates. When the feds raise rates, that's a sign that the market could possibly react to that in a negative way. Usually it's a bad thing. The stock market is going to come down when they continuously to do that. And we already knew that was going to happen. And like I told you guys, prior to Carvana and all these other stocks I had called out that went crazy, I told you we got the market was about to go crazy and it's going to come right back down even harder. And it done went crazy, came back a bit, trying to scare people and have them not knowing which way, like which way I'm going to go next. Is you going back up or is you about to go ahead and crash? In my opinion, I believe it's about to, it went up, right it came down but it ain't crash yet how it's supposed to from here i believe it will go ballistic again possibly go past the highs that it went past the first time go crazy 
And then what is going to happen is it's going to make a U-turn and come down lower than the point that we currently hit and go down even lower to then our lowest point. I believe that could possibly happen, guys, as things start to, you know, uh, as things start to heat up because they ain't done putting pressure on the people, guys. This the world is about to be totally different from what you know it as now in the next five years or so. But anyways, this conversation for another day. The stocks that I'm looking at, got on my radar right now, is a firm upstart, uh, Tilray, and uh, and a lift. We made money on lift today, in and out. We made money on a firm. Made money on upstart. Made money on Tilray. We made money. You name it. You name it. We made it. So you already know, guys, what to do. Edgeboy on Instagram at the Behave Show. Get in VIP. I love y'all. We out and God bless you. We gone.